Hello, my name is Steph. If you'd like to come on and have a seat for some symbolic support, if you are new, welcome. If you're returning, welcome home. We're going to drop some ink on this scroll, scrying for shapes and symbols that may speak to our psyche and psychic senses. We'll also add on some tarot and oracle. And where Mr. Ghosty here is, we actually have Ghost Tube Seer here kicking today for any visual inspirations that may arise from the afterlife that may add to our auric adventures. Overall, please do receive release freely. So when you're ready, let's go. Okay, we're just going to use a nice good old-fashioned black and white today. I've always found that the brain likes black and white, very contrast, and the energy likes color, consciousness co likes color. So very interesting. But you may find different. Just as a reminder, we're here to create a portal to perceive in, less worrying about making a masterpiece. As well, always feel well to comment below what you see, sense, or feel as your reflections do deep in the reading. You can drop an emoji. Any interactions with the channel is appreciated. All right, if you're opening up with me, we'll take a nice deep breath. Closing the eyes, cleansing the palate of perception, releasing the race and the rush, activating the abstract mind and ancient awareness to perceive and receive symbolic support in the name and honor of anyone here at any time, thank you for being my muse, and may you meet a message with meaning. Right. If anything is standing out to you, again, please feel well to share. Uh, you can take a screenshot, personal use only, if you want to scry in your own time. All right, so I'm playing double Dutch. I'm playing skipping over here skipping rope I'm also dribbling and basketball it's all these activities I am not that active <laughs> dribbling basketball uh, there's a gentleman here hmm he's been watching over you since you were a kid might be your birth guide or a, a parental figure in spirit specifically if that message is for one thank you for holding space for them to receive it i feel like i look up to them i look up they either wore glasses or were really cool like i just uh, okay yeah Oh, the, the, it's changing on me. I'm standing here. This is a book open. There are two very long-tailed birds. I think they're blue jays. Or something with really, really, really long tails. I have a hat on. This might be a map. This book actually might be a map. I have a map open. Okay. Yes, I'm going on a trek. I'm mapping something out of where it is that I kind of want to go. This guide that's um, up here with up um, here with me, like. They're looking at your choices too, taking a look with you. Sorry. Hmm. Where am I going on the track? Okay. I'm going to wander into some tarot and oracle. It's to a high top. Something about a high top. I'm going to get out all the cards here and then I'll bring them up to you. feel like somebody is their mother or uh, father's favorite. Sorry, there's an image coming up. I heard a sound. Yeah, it's like a rainbow road. And I'm going to head in there. Okay. Thank you. All right, let's take a
take a look on the bottom is life force energy. Something's happening up here in this high top. I can't, I can't quite see it yet. I definitely feel like there's a mother figure here as well, or somebody in that you would place in mother, grandmother, sister, auntie, somebody in spirit, very feminine. Um, and she's always like, almost like brushing the hair out of your eyes, but it's very soothing. She's in the distance. Hmm. She works with this masculine energy. If it's your birth guide or somebody in the, if it's somebody in the afterlife, I feel like they know each other. They might be related. If that's not the case for you, I feel as though this is somebody that works with your birth guide. The one that has been with you since the beginning. And she works with him. It's, it's a very soothing way. It's a, it, I don't know. She just, you might even feel, I don't know, like feathers on the face or like wisps is how I want to say that wisps. Okay. All right. In the cave of ice is leadership wandering into the cave of winds with deliberation thinking about, you know, I'm thinking about taking the lead in this map I'm going to step into that rabbit hole that I am looking at this the blue jays okay they're also squirrels now they're turning on me into squirrels your footing is on a cloud this isn't to to imply non ground groundedness this is like my my these boots were made for walking <laughs> that's just what they'll do I don't want to continue with the song because it's not how it feels. This just feels like I am. I kind of have clouds in my feet. Like I'm trying to feel and sense. Yes, thank you. In the bottom of this deck up here, like where do I want to go towards? But this, it's a light feeling, and feeling through the bottom of my feet. And you're deliberating, thinking. Maybe it's just in your day today. Where do you want to go today? How do you want your day? This bird is that a geese? Because that's up here, right? Let's see if I can do this. Right there. It's right there. It's really quite beautiful. And so it's reminding me of like that mother goose feel. I'm seeing that as a trap door. Yeah, we're still here. You might, have, you might be escaping something as well, but I'm seeing the line through there, like the windows, like omens. You might be receiving signals for, like I'm seeing what might be a rope out of a window, but it's actually leading up, like climbing up a rope. And the cave of hearth fires is playfulness. And the cave of rivers is growth. And it's beautiful because there's actually a river here. It's, I don't want to work. I just want to bang on the drum all day. I feel like I'm looking for a little bit of adventure in this day. Whenever you might find this, whatever the adventure is that you're on. And while it's serious to kind of take note, where am I going to go from here? Looking at, some of you might even be looking at your accomplishments or a vision board. Creating a vision board or looking at an old vision board that you had created. And it's almost like you can take note and take stock and use those as uh, in, uh, ambition, ambition to move forward. And then coming here in the cave of earth is abundance. And that's, if I'm honest with you, that's how I feel like I want to feel in this earthly expression with having both masculine and feminine energies within myself or others in the afterlife to those in the angelic realms to whatever you may believe in it's so beautiful but it's almost like this team effort but you're the leader you're the leader of this life and it's like where do you want to go 
How do you want to get grounded? How do you want to give to the ground? How do you want to, to move through this earthly experience? And the way this map is, maybe you might, you might be taking stock or notes of things that you're seeing, making like your own symbol, dictionary or insights, getting to know your own symbols of sorts. To others, it's this vision board thing that comes to life. You might even want to start a new one. You got to take into deliberate, I guess, deliberate. I can't say that word. I have here home. <laughs> Closing out. Some of you might be thinking about moving. Protection and justice. If there is anyone that has escaped something. Job person, place, or thing. New Beginnings is on the bottom. With life force energy over here as well. If you're thinking about moving so that you can protect yourself, feel protected, welcome the protection. Somebody's also opening up a book of shadows. Is... I know that's a book, but I'm seeing it almost like a store or an online store. And something about birds, bird symbolism, bird spells, bird uh, information. Bir I don't know, something about birds, or maybe you're just getting messages from a lot of birds. There is the most... peaceful feeling here of with any sort of justice without there having to be in some some way shape or form sorry something's coming through. so I just wanted to let you should see that oh do you know how I'm seeing that is actually uh, the depictions of the king and queen's chambers in the pyramid for some of you, it might have been a relationship and you're getting a new beginning. It's almost kind of like the best justice is to have a new beginning. Reinvigorate your life force energy where you're moving towards. And if it isn't so much in that case for you, wherever you are today, just waking up today. And if you're grumpy or growly, that's okay. Take a minute. Plant your feet. Where do you want to go today? How do you want this day to go? Have some input. Take the lead and live it. Live your lifestyle and love style one step at a time i love this this is such a nice feeling and know that you have some very large presences with you until next time so much love i hope this did serve inspire educate or entertain Bye. i'll see you tomorrow and we'll flip it we'll do it again